Hello, guys, breaking news. They just leaked LR Gallon. They just leaked LR Gallon. I'm not kidding. This is not a drill. This, they just leaked LR Gallon. Didn't I tell you guys? I did not tell you guys. Come on now. Look at him. Look. Oh, let's go back. Wait. Uh, change tab. LR Gallon. Right there. Right there. Right. Guys. Holy sh. Do I have to, like, okay, are you guys blind? Oh, wait. Yoink. Oh, that's the wrong one. Yoink. Oh, that's not how I wanted to. Yoink. Yeah, there you go. Guys, it, it's it's real, it's real, it's real, it's Ella Gallon. They saw my Elden Ring video. They definitely saw my Elden Ring video. It's Ella Gallon. Now I have to come up with a kid. I'm so scared they're gonna fuck him up tremendously. Bro, I was come. Oh my god, if they fix this passive. Oh my. So, okay, well, hold on, let me, let me, how do I, let me yoink, 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 boom. All right, let's go to this. Uh, let's go to Gallon. Uh, AK, AK, oh yeah, they missed all them on global. Yeah, I forgot. Um, so this thing right here, bro, I don't. This collapse sucks ass. I don't give a shit. Don't summon. Wait for like gallon. I'm, I'm, I can't. I said I'm gonna have a little. His coerce is broken, right? One of the best mechanics in the entire game. Okay, he just can't take hits well, very well now. Obviously, bro is four years old, but. What was really broken was he used to do it to passes in a specific way. So like when you hit Assault Melee, he applies a debuff to you, right? Uh, you get debuffed. Uh, you get the defense related down. If he coerced Melee, you wouldn't get that. Like Melee would still get the all stat uh, like buffs that he gets when he gets hit. He would still get that, but you wouldn't get debuffed. Your team wouldn't get debuffed because he's coerced. That's how it should work, right? Some run, same thing. You don't get a tax field. But then they they shadow nerfed it. They didn't even mention the patch notes. It just stopped working. I made a video about this. Uh, you can check where I showed that it used to work. Um, so now, if they buff that to work the way it should work again, when Bon on Bon's team when they attack, no attack rate down, right? No debuffs for you. Infinity Mirror, no debuffs for you. He curses like tier, no crit down for you every turn. That would be nice. That would be, like, he becomes a legit tech option. Also, this is it for his commandment. They need to upgrade his commandment too, which they haven't done with the other characters, but, like, Demon King, right, after the two turns, he gets a rank up, right? He gets a rank up, and he cleanses all debuffs, okay? I think that if you run Galland, he should get petrified after the rank up, right? He cleanses, ranks up, and then he should get petrified. That's how I think the order should work. But no, it's he ranks up, then cleanses. So the petrify never goes through, which is cringe. Same with uh, new melee, right? Heaven and Earth, he ranks up uh, and he cleanses all his debuffs. He should get petrified as well. That should be a mechanic. That should be an interaction that should exist this way, I think, right? Um, so that's nice. Now, card-wise, he has Amplify, which is the best card in the game, no cap, or coolest card at least. If he gets some sort of buffs on his thing, right? Um, the thing is, because he Chorus is an enemy, right? So this is like the, the Gallant game. This is the whole, like, you hit me, I hit you, that shit, right? Um, if they need to make it so if the Chorus target doesn't hit Gallant, they lose, they die. Or they get petrified. Oh, that's what they're going to do. That's literally what they're going to do. They're going to do it. If the Chorus target doesn't hit Gallant, and they start on the next turn, they get petrified. 100% that's what it is. Um, and then card wise, like, he needs some sort of buff. Buffing. Like, some sort of buffs in his passive. I mean, obviously, he, he'll get the stats he needs. I'm not worried about that, right? But, like, give him some sort of damage destruction against that Chorus target as well, right? Like, how um, just Lane has, like, the attack rate down for enemy, right? Or Green Freya has, like, the damage destruction, which sucks, so give him attack rate down. Um, and then some sort of, like, every, like, I don't know, like, buffs. Every time he hits the Chorus target, he gets a buff, right? That'd be nice, because you're continuing the Gallant game. That would be really fire. And then we also have um, the AoE, which would be... Um, Bleed, which I don't know if they count as a damage card or if it, as a I don't know what they count it as Because usually what they do is they add a Utility effect to a DPS card and they add a DPS effect to a utility card I don't know if you bleed is supposed to be utility or bleed uh, or damage in their books So for the amplify it's gonna be utility, right? So it's gonna be like Laurel Oak Age or something, right? Something like I don't really care like I don't know infect single target attacks on rank 2 I don't know what it's gonna be But then on AoE it's gonna be um I don't know, like, it depends. Okay, so if they want to add a damage effect, add cleave, I guess. Like, I don't know what his crit damage and crit chance will be. Uh, but right now, I mean, we can we can check on Gallant. Um, right now, Gallant... Uh, that was red Gallant. Where's blue Gallant? Uh, right now, Gallant has... 
66 base crit chance and 180 crit damage, right? Neither of those are high, right? So they're both going to go up. But if he only has like 90 or 100 crit chance, then just give him cleave because he's, he's never going to crit against real enemies, right? So just give him cleave and amplify. I like cleave too. I think, obviously, I like it better when they crit because it looks better. But cleave would just be a better card to have. Like, it's just more damage, right? Uh, but I don't, if they do some sort of, I don't know, like... I don't know, now demons are more focused on critting and stuff. I don't know. What does what Gelda have? Let me look at Gelda again. Uh, Gelda is obviously very different. Uh, yeah, Le 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 yeah, and there's literally no effect. Yeah, Zeldris, I, I can't, because he's the latest LR and he's also a demon, so like, you know, they probably want to push this somehow. Um, maybe maybe Gallant uh, gets uh, Freyr's uh, passive. Maybe Gallant gets Freyr passive, like, type stuff, where he gets... Uh, single target damage increase on his uh, right. He gets a single target increase. Also, usually they release a lot of relics. Yeah, Gallant's gonna be insane. Gallant is literally just, just gonna be insane. Like the, the best scene in the entire game. Like so insane. My dog is walking away. Like, he's he's done for. All right, he's looking. Hold up. All right. And see ya. No. Okay. Whatever. Um. Yeah. I don't know. What was I gonna say? Uh, yeah, he's gonna get a relic too, right? So he's gonna get so much more to his passive. I think the passive is just gonna like give him some sort of stats, maybe basic stats for all allies, uh, it's like demon stuff, uh, maybe attack related stats or something. And then um, the whole like if the gallant target doesn't hit him back, he gets petrified. And his holy relic, holy relic. So the holy relic, like in 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 a, in a, in a, in a word where net net marble like thinks, uh, it's gonna buff red gallant too, right? Now red gallant doesn't do much right um like he doesn't do much his passive unfortunately if this was defense related stats it would legit be good people would still run him but they don't run him so that's that's you know that you know why um and then shatter is like also shit like like, like ignores resistance right you can give him power strike instead and then removes buffs yeah i mean like we don't care about his cards well, i think honestly there's nothing you can do with this guy like anything you have gallons probably gonna work on this like any sort of damage increase right uh, maybe the relic's gonna give him buffs, right? S some some sort of way. Maybe he's gonna have um, like a Sigur type passive where he's gonna give everyone buffs for each uh, like every time they have stat downs, they're gonna get buffs. All right, my dog's coming back to me. He's uh, he's realizes the mistakes, and he is uh, I don't know. Maybe he knows like Gallant's happening, you know. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Gallant, I'm excited. Um, I have to go back to the stream because they're, they're showing like uh, her stuff now And I don't know why my stream is lagging. This doesn't make sense. But anyway, it's gallon time And they also leaked the uh, Scotty. They just leaked the uh, Scotty as well on stream um, A new Scotty on the Giants tab and yeah, so obviously an uh, insane stream and everything they, they've shown the collab and by doing so they leaked at all the good stuff that comes after the collab So I'm really excited um, yeah, that's it. I think that's Scotty, at least. I don't know. And you could see, like, on the stream, it looked more like Scotty. They also showed a Scotty, then went back. They might have even talked about her, but we don't speak Japanese, so we don't know. But yeah, that's it. Uh, Elor Gallon. 